What's up, Barkey family? Welcome back to my channel. So today for you guys, I have a Target Bullseye Playground haul. No, I did not break my hands. I'm wearing splints. I'm getting really bad carpal tunnel from pregnancy. I couldn't find the regular brace for this one, and this is like the sleeping one. So I have this thing that honestly looks like I broke my hand. Um, so we ended up going to Target because we're getting ready for like the baby, um, like a to-go home bag, delivery, take your baby away from the hospital bag. I don't know what they're called. Uh, and Matt and I haven't bought anything regarding clothes and stuff for the baby. Um, we were thinking like, oh, we're going we're gonna to get it during the baby shower. But some stuff is going on with me right now that like, I don't know if the baby's going to come sooner. So we just want to be prepared. So I ended up going to Target, getting some things for when the baby comes home with us or inside of the hospital. And then I got the welcome kit, which is really cool. It just comes with a bunch of like free samples. Uh, so anyways, when we were there, I got some things from the Target Bullseye Playground. They got new items in. It's not like the entire section was new. It's just like a little part and it's barbecue Memorial Day kind of based. Side note, if you hear some random noises, it's Matt. Matt's working on a car right outside the window with his friend and he's like walking in and out of the house. So the first item I picked up is this tear tray. Whenever Target Bullseye Playground gets a tear tray in, I more than likely will buy one. I saw online um, from other people's posts that there is a white one with black trimming, I think it was, or maybe it's white trimming. Maybe it's red trimming. I don't remember, but I remember this part was white. I didn't see that one. I got this one where it's like two metal pieces. It kind of looks like aluminum, honestly. Um, and then this red trimming. You know what would be really cute if you were having, well, I feel like a lot of people are going to be having big barbecues this year, especially this weekend. But if you had this weekend, hmm, I don't know when this video is going out, but it's Memorial Day weekend, so that's why I'm saying that. But it'd be cute if you had like little hot dogs in there and people can grab one. It'd be really cute. So yeah, I got this and it was $5, my favorite thing. The one that I've seen other people showing on Instagram with the white. That one's really nice. If I would have saw that one, I would have got that one instead, but I didn't see it at all. And I don't know when I'm going to go to Target again. The next item I got is this little basket right here. It is like a woven basket. They had them in three different colors. I got this like white one, but it's more of an off-white. And then there was a blue and a red one. And they're actually all really nice. I just know that when it comes to the blue and the red one, I'm not really going to use that to decorate, or decorate around the house. And this one I definitely would and this one was three dollars which i thought it would have been five dollars it was only three dollars and then i ended up getting this macrame um wall hanger that's what it's called it was five dollars so it's a little bit on the smaller side but i was thinking i could use this for diy i like doing the target bullseye playground diys they're always really easy to do though because the thing is already done for you but i had an idea for this one so i ended up getting it and then i got Okay, last year in the Target Bullseye Playground, they had these ceramic stackable bowls, but it looked like Ray Dunn, and I still, oh, I actually have one close nearby, because I use them to decorate with. Oh, I hope my book crack didn't show there. Anyhow, it says like dash, this one, and then the other one I have says pinch, and it's over there in a tear tray. And I really like them, and they were $3. Well, they kind of brought them back, but this time they're blue, or you can get the one that makes an American flag. And that's what I got. So it's $3, $1.50 for each one. And I really just like the American flag. So I ended up getting that because I was like, oh, that'll look cute inside of the tear tray. I ended up getting some um, floating shells. They had them in like an unfinished wood color and white. I got the white one. This was $5. And I got this because I was like, oh, I can use this in a DIY as well. And I actually have an idea for this. I'll use this like I think in a DIY and then I'm going to reuse it for the baby's nursery because my idea for the DIY involves Toy Story and I'm not going to do a Toy Story floating shelf DIY for like my video. Okay, then I got this little um, ice cream bowl, white ceramic sundae dish. I have an idea for this and I also got, dude I should grab the more interesting things but right now I have like the pretty boring stuff near me. I got these divider cups and they're silicone. And the reason I got them, they're a dollar. There was two different ones. The one that comes with two little, like, they honestly look like dipping dishes. And one where it's just like one cup. I got these for Pepper. Because when we take Pepper for walks, we like to take her on long walks. And Pepper, you know, she starts to get thirsty. And so we always carry a water bottle. And Matt will take a styrofoam cup and cut the bottom out of it and bring that inside of his pocket. Sometimes he'll bring a backpack and put like a bowl in it. 
sometimes we end up bringing one of these things. But this one is silicone, so it doesn't collapse, but it's easy to put inside of our pocket or inside of our hoodie. So I ended up getting this because I was like, oh, we could just bring this with us versus trying to cut the bottom of a styrofoam cup every single time that we take her or carrying something that's like hard glass. They have this new like pasta pizza section, but at the Target I went to, they didn't have much. They only had like bowls, a few little like cloths, but I was able to find this in that section. It is this um, picture that says meals and memories are made here. And it's really nice. It's only three bucks. There was another one that was white and it said something about like homemade is happiness. I think that's what it said, but I ended up getting this one. Then I got this tablecloth. It looks like a picnic type of tablecloth. I love this type of look. I love it so, so much. This was $3. They also had a blue one, but I got this one in particular because there was this one time I did like a Dollar Tree DIY video and a lot of the items went well with this and I was like, oh, I really want to do one of those again. We'll see if I get around to it because I keep saying like I have so many DIYs that I want to do, but half of the time I'm so out of breath <laughs> and tired that I'm like just sitting there. And lately I've been trying to focus my energy on um, cleaning out the filming room for the nursery and I've done a really good job with that. But every single time I get a boost of energy, that is what I try to do. The next item I got was just this little plant. It was $3. Um, they have them in three different colors, blue, white, and red. I got the red one. The next item I got is this utensil organizer. It was $5. It's unfinished, so there's a lot of possibilities with this. And again, I wanted to do a DIY with this one. Don't know what I'm gonna do exactly, but I know I wanted to use it for something. Definitely put things inside of it. I know that much. Durr. And the last thing that I got is a seaside bar, um, like bottle cap opener. I actually didn't choose this, Matt did. Matt's family has a lake house and he's like, you should buy this for the lake house. And there was like different designs and he's like, which one do you want? I'm like, you choose it. So it was $3. I don't know how well it works. Cause I was like thinking, you have to make sure this is like really well mounted into the wall because if it wasn't and you try to like open your bottle with it, it's just gonna go up. So I guess we'll see how it works. If not, there's just this random piece of decoration on their wall. Anyways. That is it for the items that I bought at the Bullseye Playground. I don't know if they're getting new items in anytime soon other than this like pasta, um, Memorial Day, summertime stuff. Yes, I'm out of breath still, you guys. But today, even if I wasn't pregnant, I'd be out of breath because today is 86 degrees outside. And your girl is heat sensitive. Doesn't matter if it's if I'm pregnant or not so I can really feel it inside the house I'm gonna have to drop the AC a little bit so yep that is it I hope you guys are all doing well let me know down in the comments below if you have had a baby what do I need to bring so far I got um what is it like a going home outfit and then like a pajama I don't know if I should bring more clothes I'm bringing mittens I don't know if I need them some articles I was reading said say that I need them and some say that I don't I'm bringing swaddle two different ones so I'm gonna bring a muslin muslin blanket is that what it was called muslin swaddle yeah and then I'm bringing one of the zip up type of swaddles uh what else did I get for the baby hat I know you gotta bring the car seat that's obvious otherwise they're not gonna let me take my baby home uh and i think that's all i've gotten so far i know that they give you a lot of stuff at the hospital uh but i want to bring some of my own stuff so yep i hope you guys enjoyed the video there's matt anyway i'll see you guys next time take care bye